As the dawn of the 18th century approached, the New World's allure was irresistible. This was a time of exploration and expansion, with European powers vying for control over the vast, uncharted territories across the Atlantic. France, an emerging power, was eager to assert its presence and secure its share of the New World's promise. The French explorers, braving hostile conditions and unknown perils, ventured deep into the heart of the continent, following the course of the mighty Mississippi River. This river, with its expansive delta, held strategic importance. It was not just a gateway to the continent's interior, but also a potential stronghold for trade and defense. France's ambition was clear, to establish a firm foothold in the new world, creating a nexus of trade and a bastion against rival powers. As they surveyed the Mississippi Delta, they envisioned a city that would not only fulfill this ambition, but would also embody the spirit of the new world. The stage was set for an ambitious project that would leave a lasting mark on the American landscape. In the year 1718, Jean-Baptiste Le Moyne de Bienville, acting on behalf of the French Mississippi Company, founded New Orleans. It was a time of exploration, ambition and power struggles, with the French keen on asserting their colonial dominance in the New World. Bienville, a seasoned explorer, had the foresight to recognize the strategic importance of this location. Nestled at the southern tip of the Mississippi River, the land was a gateway to the vast interior of the North American continent. It was the perfect place for France to establish a foothold, a launching point for its colonial aspirations. However, the early years of New Orleans were anything but smooth sailing. The settlers had to grapple with an unforgiving environment. The swampland was rife with disease-bearing mosquitoes and the humidity was unrelenting. The threat of hostile native tribes loomed large, adding to the settlers' woes. But the French were resolute. They built levees to hold back the Mississippi, drained the swamps and erected fortifications. They negotiated with the native tribes, sometimes through diplomacy, other times through force. Step by step, they transformed the inhospitable marshland into a burgeoning settlement. New Orleans became a hub of commerce and culture, a testament to French resilience and ingenuity. It was a city built on courage, tenacity and a dash of audacity. Thus, amidst swamps and under the threat of hostile forces, New Orleans, the jewel of French America, was born. The founding of New Orleans was more than just the establishment of a new city. It was the birth of a cultural melting pot, a city that would come to play a pivotal role in the growth of the United States. Here, French, Spanish, African and Native American cultures intermingled, creating a unique tapestry of tradition and influence. This vibrant city, born from the wilderness, has endured through centuries, its legacy woven into the fabric of our nation. From a strategic outpost in the wilderness, New Orleans has grown into a vibrant city, a testament to the enduring spirit of those early pioneers.